Hi guys, so I'm doing something a little bit different today. Uh, <laughs> I decided to play this game and it's called Your Turn to Die and I've just seen it everywhere. So I was just like, you know, why don't I try and play it, you know? Because why not? <laughs> so let's get started. Hey. Hey, Shady. Hiya. <laughs> Just a random question, but you know what a majority vote is? <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> no need to get mad. It's helpful to start conversations with an easy question. Oh, looks like someone's over here. There. Yeah. I love majority- Oh, it's Mr. Sorry. I love majority votes. They represent the way dem democracy should be. Following the will of the people. It's a method that min min minimizes conflict. I hate majority votes. They're just a way to silence the minority. It only makes more darkness built in the shadows. <sighs> Sounds like they're having a, some tedious argument. Incidentally, whose opinion do you support? Mr. Blues or Mr. or Mrs. Red? Or Miss Red? Um, you know, I don't know. Because, like, I mean, majority vote is a good idea. But at the same time, it, it really just depends on the situation. So... Um, sure, let's go for Mrs. Miss Red's, no, Mr. Blue, sure. Oh! <laughs> okay. Aw, she died. But good for you. Your opinion had more supporters. In the end, the majority is absolute. That's how it goes when you live in this society. Hmm? What's, what's, what's with that look? If you'd known the other person would die, would you wouldn't have voted? Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Sheesh, that wouldn't get you anywhere, okay? It's what this game is all about. You don't look pleased, huh? I mean, I'm not pleased, but I'm just concerned. Oh God. All right, if you insist, let's hold a vote. Your opinion versus mine. Okay, then let's go. Uh, what? Oh. oh am I dead? I think I'm dead. Yeah. Oh. I do click. Please don't hurt me. Oh. Okay. Ding dong. Ding dong. Ugh. I had a weird dream. My jaw is sore because I was sleeping with my head on my desk. This late already? I have to go home. Better hurry. skiddly ally ally there. Oh, she's so pretty! Whoa, it's gone completely dark. Touch spots that look interesting to investigate. Sure. There we go. The campus pond. If there's a room if you look at it at midnight, your reflection will talk to you. Could be a great thing to a loner. Aw, well I'm a loner. Lights on. Maybe it's the guard. Thanks for your tireless service. Seeing the school like this, it's totally different tonight. Oh, the lights flickering. Oh boy, the lights. I have to walk home when it's this dark. And it's off. The lights are off. Let's just click anywhere. Okay, the front gate of the school. Can't go home without going through it. I don't want to leave yet. I want to I wanna leave. Get me out of here, please. Oh, uh, hello. Oh, Okay, someone's there. Yeah, I, I kind of saw that, you know, just looking through the thing. It scared me. What you doing, Sarah? <laughs> Joe, Joe or Ju Tazuna, or rather Joe, my classmate at school. We often found ourselves together. You stuck around this late for clubs? I was gonna wither up from waiting. Well, it's fine. Listen, there's something I want to tell you. Something to tell me? My thanks. Oh, you know, you introduced us, right? Me and Ryoko. Right. She's such a good girl. I moved. Cute, huh? Adorable. I ate a donor kebab in one bite today. I'm a real glutton. A whole donor kebab. Wait, you went on a date? <laughs> Or was on it till just a second ago. I came back to school so I could brag about it to you. 
We should have just gone home. All right, bragging complete. Let's go home, Sarah. Aww. Oh, okay. Um, oh, okay. And then save. We'll save, even though we shouldn't really need to save, but let's move. Let's go to the path home. And then Ryoko and I finally, how long you've been missed this story? You listening? We made huge progress. This guy's such a pain. Did you kiss or what? <laughs> K don't be stupid. Doing that on the first date? They call people like that monsters. We held hands. Outrageous progress, right? I mean, it was mostly that I fell in the ditch and she was helping me out, but for how gaudy you look, you're awfully shy. <laughs> huh? Gaudy, this ain't it. This ain't it, chief. <laughs> I'm hurt, man. Just seriously get to me. Damn it. Maybe I should go get a crew cut like in middle school. And now he started moping. Okay, do I... A poster warning to watch out for strangers. Okay, what's this? No, what's this? What's this? Da 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 da. What's this? Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh, a uh, faint street light illuminates the area. I've rarely ever walked home at this hour. It feels really dark. What's up? Wanna hold hands? Uh, you know... I kinda wanna go for it, just because I'm gonna go for it. Yeah. I'd probably crush you with my amazing grip. Nah, forget it, Sarah. No! How could you do this to me? Oh god. Okay, so that's... Huh, well now I can check back the log. That's cool. Okay. Since when do you have an amazing grip? But real talk, wouldn't it help? Th uh, blah, blah, wouldn't it help things if you got a boyfriend? Uh, uh, you can't sleep, right? Because of your stalker. Is that why you always go home with me? D dummy, I just wanted to brag. Aw, thank you. For what, man? Well, if you just. If you just feel like being grateful, I won't stop you. <laughs> All right, let's mosey along now. Your parents will be worried if you're late. Right. I mean, it is. Oh, pretty late. All right. I have to run. Joe, run. Huh? Bada 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 bingo bada boom bada boom. <laughs> ha, you. We made it home. It's okay. Should should be fine now since we're here. Joe, I'm scared. I mean, I am terrified, but I'm scared. I'm so scared. Am I going to... What if he kills me someday? I'm not going to let that happen, okay? Joe, call on me anytime. I'll come with a boatload of freshmen. Aww. That guy was staring, and... It seemed like he was trying to talk to me. Oh, I just realized the little, the little puppy in his pouch. Oh, that, that's super cute. Oh, my God. Well, your parents are waiting, Sarah. Yeah. Hey, Joe. Oh, thank you, or be careful. Be careful. Yeah. See you tomorrow at school. Okay, I guess I'll go in. Hmm? The house lights are on? Nani? I can see the living room through the window. But the lights aren't on. The lights aren't on. Okay, lights aren't on. Okay. A fancy light lights up the front porch. So it's not a power outage? The house nameplate. Oh, guess we go to the door. My good old front door. Oh, uh, the door's unlocked. Okay. Looks like tree, cabin, all right, inside. I'm terrified. Okay, that's, mm, it's dark. Why aren't the lights on? Mom, dad, are you not home? The plant's falling over. Something's weird about this house. Over there's the bathroom, the living room. Normally, mom would be in there waiting, me in here watching TV and waiting for me. Back there is the door to my parents' room. And then this is just upstairs. Upstairs, my room is up there. Okay, living room, second floor. I 
Why can't I go to my parents' room and make sure they're okay? Living room. It's pitch black, like my future. This is bizarre. <laughs> JoJo's is <the> adventure. <laughs> Sorry. There can't be no one in here. Oh, turn on the lights. Uh, light switch. Light switch. Light switch. I have a bad feeling. Uh, cancel then. I am risking it. Too dark to see. Uh, the, um, can I like move? Go back to the hallway and then maybe go upstairs. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, you know what? Oh, it's locked. Who came in and locked the door to the room? Not dad, right? Okay, then we should probably go back and that's the only thing we can do. <sighs> okay. Mm. Turn on. I don't care if you have a bad feeling. We're turning on the lights. Okay, turning them on. Oh! Hi, mom. Mom. Mom, mom. Okay. Mom, hang in there. She's breathing. It looks like she fainted. What do I do? What do I do? There's a key on the floor. Retained room key. Why is this here? Okay, uh, we're gonna go hallway. <gasps> Sarah! Oh, God, Joe! Hi! Joe, please help. My mom's collapsed. Stay calm. Did you call the hospital? The cops? Not yet. I need, I need a call. I'll handle it. Listen, Sarah, you need to be calm. Aw, thank you, Joe. Joe started making the call. What am I doing? I'm all out of sorts, but I need to do something, something. Uh, second room floor. We have a key, so it's probably for that one because it's locked. It's locked. Uh, this is probably a bad idea, but you know, I'll open it. Use the room key. The door opened. Please don't do anything that. Oh, okay. We just click it. Okay. <gasps> Dad? Dad, are you here? Mom collapsed. Dad, where are. I have a bad feeling. I have a really bad feeling. I have a bad feeling. <gasps> oh. Hi, hands. I'm guessing there'd probably be like a screech there or something. Your turn to die. Death game by majority. Heck yeah. Okay. Uh, presented by Nankidai. Thank you, Nankidai, for presenting this game. Because this is super fun so far, and I'm terrified. Haha! <laughs> uh, oh, here we go. Where is this? I wonder. Am I looking at the ceiling? Why am I sleeping here? Remember the situation, remember myself. Uh, remember myself. I'm Sarah, and an incredibly normal person attending school. Good. Start with what you know best. Uh, situation. Uh, I think I went home? Right, and then mom- Mom! I quickly tried to sit up, but I couldn't. Is there something in my head? Uh, think calmly. Right, now it seems I'm lying down. On the bed, maybe? What is this thing on my head? Touch it to check. I fearfully touch my head. Some kind of belt or machine. Am I tied to it? It's like I'm being restrained. No way! Uh, what's the meaning of this? My temperature rose. Suddenly, fear awakened in me. No! Where is this? Somebody- I had no freedom to move. Besides my head, my left arm, torso, and my legs also seemed to be restrained. All I could do was move my right arm. Someone- I was about to scream, then went quiet. The stalker. He harmed my mom. And he brought me here. I wonder, am I going to be killed? I'm terrible at acting. I'm sorry. Joe! Yay! Sarah, are you there? That voice. Joe, is that you? Are you next to me? Yeah, but I can't move. Can't you do something? Joe's in the same situation? Okay. A phone? Um. Ask Joe. Joe, is that yours ringing? Uh, you're right. Something in my pockets. Here. Hello? Whoever you are, help us! Beginning voice guidance. Huh? The first trial will now begin. Sarah and Joe, find the key hidden in this room. Then remove your restraints. If you cannot do so before the time limit expires, the devices on your, be your beds will activate, and your bodies will be crushed by the thud. By all means, please enjoy this thrill with all your body and soul. The time limit is a healthy five minutes, 
And note, there's only one key, so please discuss who will use it. Oh boy. What the heck is this? The first trial? We'll die in five minutes? What, what are we gonna do? There's no time to fret about that. Um, okay, let's search pocket. I searched my pocket with a free hand, but found nothing. That's Joe. Joe, check your clothes. Yikes. When I look at my phone in my pocket, I might have dropped something. No way! Pick it up! Got it! Sounds like a key. Grabbed it! It's the key! Alright! Um... Use the key. Yeah. Hurry and use the key! You sure? If I do, you'll... That voice was telling you the truth. I might die. But... Joe, I'm sure you can figure out something. Or something out. Got it. I'll use it. Then I'll save you too. Definitely! That's probably gonna kill me. I'm not gonna be surprised if I die. If I die? Damn it! That took some time. I need to save Sarah somehow. Uh, yeah, okay. Green lock. What should I do? Uh, cancel. Okay. Save your hands. Hmm. What should I? What is this? One three seven four is written on the wall. Oh God! I got two minutes. Uh, what are these numbers? And then Sarah died. Green dot. Green the dial. Oh, one three seven four. Yes. One, three, seven, four. Okay, perfect. Did I just make a sound? That's it? Okay. Um, here we go. What is this? Is this thing? I, no. An iron door. Iron door. I can't just stay behind. Uh, green lock. What should I do? Red glove dealer. Try it. It's too big to fit. Is it useless? No, it can't be useless. Um, there on the can't be broken by force. Um, oh, so good. I checked everything room and I still got no idea. What is the key fit anyway? Should I take a look at the key again? What key? I want to change with it. There's a chill out that is the end of the key. The green is showing at the scraped end. I get it. It was once a green key in the red, red was some second. I'm going to go scrape wood. Damn paper. Yes. Okay. Uh, I scraped it off with the red wood and then it ended up swinging over itself. Okay. Green lock. What should I do? Uh, red color key. Yes! Okay, it's unlocked. Oh, that scared me. Really? I'll remove these restraints now. Oh, thank God. Oh, man. If I failed on the first challenge, I wouldn't have forgiven myself. Thank you, Joe. Can you stand? There's a door here. Let's get out pronto. Uh, wait, Joe. What? Damn it, it's pitch black. Like my future. Uh, can't see a thing. Go along the wall. Left is a dead end. It seems we can only go right. I mean, I mean it, Sarah. Don't let us get separated. Right. We kept going straight ahead, but as far as we walked, we didn't see any light. It seemed very long hallway, or maybe we weren't vanishing much at all. Joe, uh, use phone. That phone you used earlier because you tried to use it in the light of the way. It's a nice one, Sarah. Man, you're smart. Did you bring it? I left it back there. Oh, she gets upset then. Hmm. What can give us some light? We're searching around the house, and suddenly, what? Whoa. Nani Deska, wind blowing from underneath. My feet left the ground. Am I falling up? No, we're falling? The floor gave way. Great! Uh, how long? How high? How far are we falling? I feel my senses growing distant. Okay. I'm going a little bit too fast, but I'm sorry. Hey, get up. Or I don't know if it's a girl or guy, but if it's a girl, well, oh, we found some familiar faces, and it was a guy. Okay, now to get actual voice acting in. Hello. You can't sit here. They're stupefied forever, miss. Uh, where is this? Beats me. Uh, I'm alive. I'm not even hurt. Oh, we have some bunch of faces. Okay, that, for a second, that looked like Hakagure, and that's Kameda, or Kameda, I mean. People, oh my god. Who the hell are you guys? Where even is this? Like, we've got, I, or, I, no, that's the same voice as the other guy. Like, we've got any idea ourselves. Calm down, lady. Is there no one here who can explain? What is, just, what is going on? How troubling. They seem to distracted to take any notice of me. What in the world is happening? Okay, let's go one by one with each person. How about that? 